Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about Cash App and more specifically, I'm going to answer a question I've gotten a few times lately, and that is, can you use Cash App as your primary checking account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, it's gonna be a quick video, but I'll go over a couple of important things you wanna consider if you're using Cash App as your primary checking account. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, if you're not familiar with Cash App, it's definitely one of the more popular peer-to-peer -peer payment apps out there. Basically, it's an easy way for you to transfer money from friends or family members almost instantly. And this is the app right here. It's this green and white one right here. If you don't have this app already, check my video description. I'll try to leave a quick link there, but I'm gonna go ahead and open my Cash App now. Okay guys, I went ahead and opened up my Cash App and this is the home screen here. Here on the home screen, you can easily request money and pay money by clicking on these buttons. But is using Cash App as your primary checking account ideal? And first off, I'm going to say no, it's probably not an ideal thing to use Cash App as your primary checking account. Although it is very useful, it can definitely complement having another account. But a few reasons why I wouldn't recommend using Cash App as your primary checking account. First off, one, you don't get any paper checks with Cash App. So most of the time these days you can pay with either cash, credit card, or debit card. But there are a couple of instances where folks will require a paper check to make payment. So things like maybe your rent or a mortgage payment or something like that. They don't take cash and they don't take debit cards. So for that particular situation, this would not work Cash App using as a primary checking account for the obvious reason of lacking any kind of paper checks that are come with this account. So that's the first reason why I would not use Cash App as a checking account. The second reason is because even though Cash App does provide a debit card, a debit card, it's called the Cash App Cash Card. It's this one right here. So these things are really useful because you can use them at most places that accept Visa debit card. However, unlike a traditional account like Chase or Bank of America, there are some online companies that do not accept the Cash App Cash Card. Why they don't accept it, I have no idea but I've done a lot of videos on Cash App. And as you can see through the comments, a lot of people message me saying that their Cash App cash card just doesn't work. And one of those places that it doesn't work is on the Uber app. That's one example. Now that's at the time of the recording of this video. Of course, Uber is a huge company and so is Cash App. So it is possible in the future you might be able to use this, but as far as I'm aware, it does not work on Uber. So again, the second reason why I would not use Cash App as a primary checking account is because their Visa debit card for some reason is not accepted at some online retailers. And the third reason I wouldn't really use Cash App as a primary checking account is because in order for this app and card to function properly, you have to have it connected to a traditional bank account. So if you're going to use it as a primary checking account, why would you have two accounts? You just don't really need it. In order for you to use Cash App as a primary checking account, I think that you would not have to have any other bank account and you can use this as primary. However, Cash App is dependent on you having another traditional bank account. That other bank account is used to fund your Cash App if you're gonna be adding money into it. So the fourth reason why I wouldn't really recommend using Cash App as a primary checking account is because of deposits. So the nice thing about Cash App is you can use their routing number and account number once you verified your account and got a Cash App cash card. Once you have a routing number and account number, then your employer can direct deposit your paycheck directly into your Cash App. So that's really convenient. However, if you're a cash worker, like say maybe a waiter and you get cash tips, and you want to deposit that into your cash app, it just doesn't work that way. They don't have an option that allows you to deposit cash, green cash, into your cash app. So that's a lot different than say your Bank of America or your Chase or Wells Fargo Bank. If you have a stack of cash and you want to deposit it into your bank account, it's pretty easy. You just go to the ATM or you go to your bank branch, give them the money, and then they deposit it into your electronic account. However, with Cash App, that's just not an option. So if you have green cash, you cannot put it into your Cash App. It's just not an option. So there you have it, guys. If you're thinking about using Cash App as your primary checking account, I probably wouldn't recommend it for those particular reasons. However, if you use Cash App as your primary checking account, leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you're able to manage that. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.